With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question is boiling point composition diagram of the liquid vapor equilibrium for A and B is shown in the figure. If the binary liquid mixture of A and B is distilled fractionally, which of the following observation would be correct observation? So in this question, we are given a boiling point composition diagram of the liquid vapor equilibrium for A and B. Two components. If a binary liquid mixture of A and B is distilled fractionally, so we have to find out which of the given observation will be correct. Now if we see this the composition diagram for two components A and B. If we see this is in vapor liquid e equilibrium. So if this is liquid vapor equilibrium it means this should be their boiling points. Now we can see if this is for A that is TA and this is for TB it means B has higher boiling point than A. Boiling point of B is greater than the boiling point of A. Because if we draw this line here, intersection line, so that will give us that boiling point of B is greater than the boiling point of A. Now, if they are fractionally distillated, if fractional distillation is done, So fractional distillation, this is done to separate the components having different boiling points. Separate the components from mixture. Having different boiling points. And in fractional distillation, Firstly, the evaporation is done. After that, the condensation is done. So, if we do the fractional distillation of these A and B components, the A, B has higher boiling point than A. So, if B has higher boiling point than A, it means B will evaporate slowly than A. B will evaporate slowly than A, but it is having higher temperature, higher boiling point, so it will condense easily. It will condense more fast, fast. So if it will condense more fast, it means it will be obtained in residue. And A having lesser boiling point, it will evaporate more. So, if it will evaporate more, it is obtained in the distillate. Evaporate more. So, obtained in distillate. So, we can say that the composition in the composition B will be present in the residue. Because it is having higher boiling points, so it will evaporate less. It means it is it will require higher temperature to evaporate, but it will condense more fast, so it will be obtained in the residue. But A is having lesser boiling point, so it will evaporate at lesser temperature, so evaporate more and it is obtained in the distillate. So the correct option or observation to this question will be First is given composition of the residue will approach liquid B only. So it is true that residue approach B and distillate approach A. So C option will be correct that distillate approaches A, pure A and residue approaches pure B. So this is the C is the correct answer. I hope you understood the solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. 
ट्रस्टेड बाई मोर देन फाइव करोड़ स्टूडेंट्स डाउनलोड डाउट एंड आप टूडे